With Christmas just round the corner and the warm summer months ahead, I'm here today at my local to see what gourmet goods they have on their shelves so I can whip up some Christmas festive feasts. The general store in Melville has only been open for a few weeks now. Having some serious DNA in the gourmet deli game, its owners, Mark Foster and Luke Clayton, who also own the Angelo Street Market in South Perth. Their passionate approach to local produce, community interaction and good old fashioned hospitality means they are kept busy for the right reasons. Now luckily for me, the general store is in my hood and it's quickly becoming my go-to place for my morning coffee and an awesome Conti roll that's giving some of the bigger names in Perth a run for their money. But today I want to dive a bit deeper and show you why this place is so special. The general store has a no-waste policy. Everything is used to make sauces, relishes, and any fruit waste gets dehydrated. In a world of supporting local, they are really ticking the box. Now behind the scenes here, there's a team of chefs making everything from scratch, from 13 hour cooked briskets to making over 500 fresh rolls every day. This really isn't your normal corner deli. What I love about the general store is the produce on the shelves and the fridges. It's the small additions to meals that make it really great. Some fresh shaved prosciutto, some seasonal fruit or vegetables, or a wedge of your favourite cheese. Now we've got the goods, we're going to duck off back to mine and I'm going to show you how easy it is to whip up a gourmet meal. This is my pimped out potato salad with prosciutto, some local asparagus and some pickles. This is a great one to have in your back pocket. Okay, let's start with the potatoes. We're going to cook them for about 10 to 12 minutes. Let's crisp up the prosciutto now. We're just sandwiching it between two trays and a bit of baking paper on the top and then a nice heavy tray. And then that goes into the oven at about 180 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. Moving on to the dressing. Today we're just using a little bit of creme fraiche. Touch of some Dijon mustard. And then the juice of about half a lemon. A good splash of olive oil. A little bit of chopped dill, just very roughly. Season that with a little bit of salt, and this is going to bring everything together lovely. Okay, now the potatoes are ready, we're just going to slice them up and just layer the salad, which gives it this beautiful, fresh effect. A few capers, and then with the dill pickles, we're just going to find all the gaps. What we're going to do now is we're going to dress the salad, and those potatoes are going to soak up all the flavour in that. Okay, a lovely asparagus here. Some shallots, just scattered over the top. Okay, the prosciutto is ready. I can smell it, it smells delicious. It's crispy, it's salty, and it's gonna add all the balance to this salad. Now we're done, this looks delicious, smells delicious, and it would be a great addition to any Christmas meal. This next dish is called pan con tomat. It's just amazing at the start of summer. We've got day old bread, overripe tomatoes, and some garlic and some beautiful olive oil. We're gonna cut our day old bread now, drizzle it with some olive oil, and then just pop that into the pan to crisp it up a little bit. Okay, this bread is perfect. We're gonna grate these beautiful ripe tomatoes now. We're adding a bit of texture and acidity. Okay, and now we just season this up a little bit. A little bit of olive oil, a good pinch of sea salt. Okay, we're just gonna spread these tomatoes all over the bread now. And this bread is just gonna suck all the juices up. Now, it's as simple as that in Spain, with a good splash of olive oil, a little bit of salt. I've got some lovely white anchovies here. It's a perfect little snack for lunch in summer, and always a little bit more olive oil. Okay, there you have it. Two simple dishes, using some beautiful local ingredients, a perfect addition to any summer barbecue.